A buckle is an old-fashioned dessert that is built in layers. I like to control my portions to three small 125 ml mason jars and use the jars to cook and serve the buckle to avoid transferring the food more than once. But as an added benefit, the layers show through the glass mason jar for an inviting presentation too. The top crumb layer is nicely round and crisp like a soft cookie with berry juice spilled on top. The middle layer looks like it's overflowing with fruit and the bottom looks nicely browned. I added a scoop of Demerara ice cream and served the buckle with a demi tasse spoon. A blueberry lemon buttermilk buckle is a simple breakfast batter overfilled with fruit and cooked with cookie dough on top to create a crumble texture and baked on butter to create a shortbread cookie crust. The Demerara ice cream melts into the buckle and adds that earthy candy like touch. To make the crumb topping, I scaled 20 grams of cold butter cut into small pieces, 25 grams stone ground cake flour, 25 grams cinnamon sugar, and mixed them all together in a small mixing bowl. I rubbed the butter into the flour and sugar using my fingers until the mixture was roughly the same crumbled texture. I spread 10 grams of room temperature butter evenly on the bottom of three 125 milliliter mason jars. I placed the jars in a high sided frying pan and set them aside while I assembled the batter. For the dry ingredients I scaled 25 grams stone ground cake flour and 15 grams cane sugar and a pinch of salt. For the wet ingredients I scaled 25 grams of buttermilk, the zest of a lemon and an egg. I placed the eggs on a dry towel to help hold the bowl in place as I mixed in the flour. I mixed just until combined and divided the batter evenly between the three mason jars. I added 40 grams of blueberries to each jar and made sure that the blueberries were completely covered in batter. I divided and spread the crumble topping evenly over the battered fruit and baked the buckles in a 350 degree Fahrenheit oven for 45 minutes. I let the buckle cool down before serving. Tightly wrapped, the buckles will last two or three days at room temperature, but are so much better eaten less than an hour after they are made. To make Demerara ice cream, I mixed four large egg yolks with 60 grams Demerara dark brown sugar, five milliliters of vanilla extract, 200 grams of high fat cream, and 200 grams of whole milk in a large mixing bowl. I poured the custard into a freezer bag draped over a mason jar to make it easier to fill the bag and added the custard to a water bath to cook sous vide style. An immersion circulator heats the water to a constant temperature and gently circulates the water in the water bath to ensure uniform heating for long periods of time. I set the immersion circulator temperature at 85 degrees Celsius and set a timer for one hour. I transferred the hot custard to an ice bath to cool down before storing the ice cream custard in the refrigerator overnight. I strained the custard through a fine mesh sieve and when the machine was all frosty like, I turned on the paddles and added the custard. The ice cream is done when it is coming away from the sides of the mixing bowl, has formed into a rolling ball and is sticking to the paddles. I like to freeze ice cream in 125 milliliter mason jars because it makes it easier to control my portion size and it makes it easier to serve. I tightened the lids and placed the jars into the freezer to harden.